A wind comfort study consists of combining meteorological data with aerodynamic information and a comfort criterion. The perception of wind at the ground level is mainly influenced by wind speed and wind direction. The way wind is experienced affects pedestrian comfort, safety, and even the financial returns for the building and the surrounding commercial activities. To address those issues in an architectural project, understanding comfort criteria is a must. A comfort criterion is a standard by which pedestrian comfort is defined. A wide range of different wind comfort criteria exists. Most of them are based on a maximum allowed exceedance of a speed threshold. In other words, the criteria set a threshold wind speed and then says how much wind speeds can go beyond that threshold. A light breeze, for instance, can be experienced for a longer time without being uncomfortable. But being exposed to a high wind speed for a long time can be uncomfortable and even dangerous. Let's put it into practice. The next two videos will show two commonly used comfort criteria with practical examples.